Hey everybody, it's Steve here. Welcome back to Mega Man 2. Uh, this is the uh, final episode of Mega Man 2. Uh, we just finished the boss gauntlet. Uh, this final capsule, uh, as I stated before, takes you directly to Dr. Wily. What you're going to do basically is equip your metal blades and just uh, just beat the hell out of them. You're going to throw them at a diagonal. Uh, once you whittle down this first uh, progress bar, uh, energy bar of his, uh, another one will uh, will appear. Yeah, it's gonna be able to get actually gonna be able to get a look at him here. There he is. He gets uh, another energy bar, and you just gotta do the same thing all over again. Now his attack pattern changes a bit. Looks like I gotta use another energy tank. My last one too, which means I'm gonna have to do something else in this game uh, perfectly. But uh, we'll talk about that in a minute. There's nothing like a, uh, a fight with Dr. Wily. It's just, there's something so... Just so great about it. And, and that's a horrible word, but, uh... It's just a great feeling when you finally fight Dr. Wily. So just when you think it's over, it's not. Um, another staple of the Mega Man games is going to be this, that after you defeat Dr. Wily, um, there's an extra stage where you have to fight him again. Gotta love that silence. <laughs> you know, like the first time I played this, it was like watching uh, Mega Man fall through four screens in just complete silence, wondering if it was just gonna go on forever. Uh, pretty straightforward here. Just dodge the uh, the dripping, whatever you want to call this stuff. I'll call it acid. And uh, it's time to uh, face Dr. Wily for the final time for this game, anyway. Oh, or am I giving away too much for the future games? There he is, but wait, he's changing into an alien? That's just bizarre. So you can use your bubble light on him. His pattern is really simple. It's a figure eight. That's all he does. Is he keeps going into figure eight. Shooting at you once in a while. Once you got his pattern down, it's really not that difficult to avoid. I could probably do this whole fight without getting hit a single time. I used to be able to. Uh, we'll see what happens this time. That's all there is to it, really. It's just a pretty long, drawn-out battle, that's all. I think I'm doing two damage to him? Or is it just one, really? It might just be one. I, I can't keep looking up at the... at the energy meter. So I guess uh, after this game is done, I uh, it's uh, it's vlog time. I guess feels like I've been a while since I've done one of those. Uh, and obviously, I think uh, in this one, what I'm gonna have to talk about is uh, my latest attempt to quit smoking, which is still going all right. But I, I will talk about that when I do the vlog. I guess I feel like my voice sounds really weird right now. Like I got a frog in my throat or something. I don't know. I think it's the way I'm sitting. Gosh, I'm sorry for the silence, I just really don't have anything much to talk about, uh, especially in such a straightforward, repetitive battle like this. Two more hits is going to do it. And there you go. Once you defeat uh, the alien, you find out that uh, it was just like some robotic contraption of Dr. Wily's. There's the real Dr. Wily, and he has been uh, controlling... Uh, that alien robot from uh, behind the scenes here. And once again, he freaks out and, you know, begs for mercy. And I guess once again, Mega Man for just forgives him, just like in the first game. You know, just lets him go, forgives him. I'm trying to think about it too much. Um, as is standard, at the end of the game, Mega Man returns home. Uh, this one's a little bit different than the first one. Um, kind of, you, know, you instead of a side-scrolling view, he's walking toward the camera. 
Apparently he walks for a really long time because the seasons keep changing. I don't know. Other than that, there's really not much to say. That's the end of the game. Uh, credits are going to roll here in a minute. Mega Man's going to find his way home and he's going to leave his helmet laying on, uh, on the ground. You know, as if to say that he's done fighting for, uh, for today at least. Um, obviously, as many people know, this particular Mega Man game is the, you know, just the pinnacle of the series, really. Um, it's the game that uh, all others would kind of look to to try and, you know, often often duplicate, often imitated, but never duplicated, I guess is the phrase I'm looking for. Here's uh, interesting that uh, they start numbering the robots. Um, obviously there were six uh, in the first game. Uh, as well as uh, Mega Man and Roll, so they count. So there were actually eight robots in the first game. So uh, these ones should go up to 16, I think. That should be it, yeah. Music here is pretty cool, of course. Uh, another staple in the game would be the bizarre names uh, in the credits. You know, Tompon, AK. I mean, I think there's actually a fish man in here. You know, y y Yuki Chan's Papa, that's another one that appears in a lot of the games. But, um, I think later in the series they actually, like, deliberately poked fun at this fact and started, I think in, like, you know, Mega Man 9 and 10, they started slipping, like, deliberately fake names, I believe. At least they sure look like it. You know, those are two games that really poke fun at the whole series in general. Very tongue-in-cheek. Um, but that's it for uh, Mega Man 2. Uh, coming up next, yeah, there's Fish Man, see? Um, coming up next is going to be a vlog. Uh, thank you for playing. Thank you for watching. Anybody who happens to watch this, I appreciate it. Uh, everyone have a good day. Take it easy. Peace. And I will uh, uh, I'll, uh, see you soon, okay? Bye.